My name is Maggie Ford Danielson. I'm Benefits Global Beauty Authority. What is in my makeup bag? Ta-da! There we go. Benetint. This is the first product that we ever made at Benefit. I still use it to this day. Benefit started two years before I was born. So it kind of benefit is like my big sister. Growing up in a family full of crazy benefit ladies was just that, pretty crazy. Gotta have a brow product. This is the Goof Proof Brow Pencil in shade three, a must have. I feel like if I fill my brows in, then I feel I can like see my face. Like I feel naked if I'm not wearing my brow product. Um, this one is Boing Concealer in shade number two. This is the airbrush formula. This one time that my mom couldn't find a babysitter for me, I was probably, I don't know, five or six years old. And she brought me into the store and she put me in the corner and just watched as women came in. My mom and aunt put makeup on them. It was like the best day. And I just remember that really clearly, like that moment of, you know, just being immersed in this world of like female, like makeup and shit chat and it was like awesome. I have bobby pins. I love these packs that come in two different colors. So obviously I have brown hair and I don't know about you, but every time I use one, I always lose it. So they're like kind of disposable. So I just always have a fresh pack. My powder, I am one of those shiny girls. I have to have a powder with me all the time. You know, it's always good to have fresh pack. There are actually men in my family. People are shocked to know that. <laughs> I've never seen my husband put Benefit products on him, but that doesn't mean it hasn't happened. <laughs> I'm gone a lot from home, so you never know what he's doing when I'm away. Dry shampoo. Ultimate must have. I'm again, oh, I said I need a pow powder for the face, powder for the hair. I need powder all the time. I'm kind of an oily girl. Gotta have some great lip balm to keep your lips hydrated. So people ask me a lot about this makeup bag. It's a little beat up, not gonna lie to you. It's like actually quite filthy on the inside. It's great, I can't live without it. <laughs> So the first Benefit product I ever tried was quite honestly Benetton. It's just like a really beautiful product and it's great to like as a beginner product because it doesn't take a lot of skill to use it. You feel like really great because you're like using makeup but it doesn't, you don't look overdone. But now as an adult, you know, I think that I'm still looking for that same effect with makeup. I just want to look natural. I want to look refreshed. Um, so I still use it. <laughs> Not the same bottle though. <laughs> This, I love going to hotels because they always have these like ridiculously small packs of um, Q-tips and you never want to bring like a whole thing of Q-tips with you. You can use them to touch up your makeup. You can like clean up anything. They're just always good to have. Hand sanitizer, great to have. I've got two kids, plus I travel a lot. So I'm like constantly full of germs. So this is a must. The food here is amazing. Someone told me the other day that it's like a national pastime is eating here in Singapore and I like completely support that. And then last but not least, also, as honestly, almost as important as the dry shampoo would be my emergency uh, 1000 milligram vitamin C powder. If I could bring coffee with me in my makeup bag, I would do it as well, but I can't. So that is it. This keeps me um, feeling human and sane on the road. So don't forget that during the entire month of May, every time you visit the Benefit Brow Bar for a brow wax, 100% of the proceeds go directly to our two charity partners, here in Singapore, Girls the Pioneers and Ida, two amazing organizations. So book your brow wax during the month of May. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Daily Vanity on YouTube. Uh, thanks so much, and I will see you next time. Bye. Whose makeup bag would I like to see the most? Anna Wintour, like what does she have in there? And then like, what are her essentials? You know, you have access to everything if you're someone like her. Does she wear just like drugstore makeup? Is she wearing makeup that hasn't even been launched yet? Like what does she have in there? It's like a mystery. So I feel like I would want to see that.